Hello everybody, uh, welcome back to another little quick uh, video. Um, I just thought I would record this segment of a road um, which actually leads from uh, Connell to Benaw, or from my perspective Benaw to Connell right now. Um, it's a wee single track country lane as most of the roads that I drive on normally are. Uh, and it's a place that I've never actually, I've driven on this road a few times, but I've never been this far up. Ow. Um, so I thought, let's just make a little quick Ow. recording of it, unless my spine gives out the first before that. And there's a big woman Arctic coming towards me. Excellent. Just what I need, big tanker. I'm just gonna bounce on the here. Hoit, hoit. That's a very shiny tanker, holy crap! My god, the reflection on that tanker was insane, my god. Uh, there is actually a quarry on this road behind me, hence where that, that's probably where that tanker's going. Uh, what the quarry produces, I have no idea. I think it might be some sort of limestone or lime or something like that. I'm not 100% sure what it actually produces. But I just thought that this is a very interesting little section of road, so I thought, why not record it? Let's just make a wee quick video of it. That was a nice Ford Ranger, I like that one. You do get certain parts of it where you can actually, you're right up against the water, and it's actually a really nice place to drive. Um, it was sunny up until about 10 minutes ago. Ow! Um, that was a tree. Uh, it's still somewhat warm, it's 13 degrees right now, so it's not exactly uh, roasting, but it's still not cold as it was this morning. This morning I woke up, and I can't believe I'm saying this at the end of May, January, February, March, April, no, the end of April, sorry, that it was like minus two degrees, and I had to scrape my car. I just don't understand that and certain people are probably going to blame that on global warming and everything like that and yeah that's probably a fair point actually but still. Um, the road itself is actually not the worst road I've ever driven on to be fair. Um, some of the single track roads I drive on aren't the best in the world. This one seems to be not too bad but I think that's because it's maintained partly by the quarry I believe. Um, this is the road that all the dumper trucks go up and down. I will admit it's not the most exciting road in the world. Um, it's purely a single track road to get you from Benaw to Connell or from Connell to Benaw and that's about it. Um, most of it for the time at the moment is like this kind of, you're kind of driving through like a forestry and tree area and it's not very exciting. But once we get a little bit further up, um, it does clear to where all the trees and that start opening up and then you get to see the nice view of the water. Uh, there's quite a few farms around this area as well. I've delivered to two of the farms on this road. Um, they do get regular deliveries from us, uh, just like feed and stuff like that, and hay, etc. Or straw, whatever it is. One of the two. I apologise if I sniff all the time, I'm still recovering from a cold. But it's actually not, it's actually a nice, I think during the, the proper summer time. Um, it'll be a nice road to just have a wee cruise down and then you can go and sit at the end of the road before the quarry because there's a big sort of opening there and just watch or look across the water and into the lock. It's, uh, it's actually a nice wee place to drive. Um, the distance isn't actually that long to get back to like the main sort of village of Connell where the Connell Bridge is. It's only about, I don't know, six, seven miles long, but because again it's like this, it's all single track, it just takes that little bit longer because you just need to take your time. Um, 
going round them, especially all oh, these blind bits. That was a bit of a problem. I mean, there's the there's the lock in front of us. So you can see some of the, the Scottish salmon farms there in the water.
farm just on the right hand side. I don't know if you can see it on camera, you might not be able to see it on camera. Can you see the sheep? You can see the sheep. That farm I've delivered to once. Really nice farm. Really nice farm. There's not a lot of like arable farms up in this area, it's more to do with livestock and stuff like that. Um, we just don't have the, the land or the, the contoured land to actually warrant doing arable farming. You'd have to have some of the most powerful machines in the world to try and get up some of these fields and on the, like the, the gradients on them is ridiculous. Thank you so much for watching, I'll see you in part two.